viewers welcome to our first concept tv headline tribunal on fire tension arises as tunubu moves to bar obi from future election his lawyer react tribunal proceeding took on unexpected and intensive tone with peter obi lawyer responding passionately to an objection aimed at preventing the politicians from participating in future election the cartoon was ablaze with tension as the high stake legal battle unfolded, posing a crucial challenge to Peter Obi's candidacy in upcoming election. With unwavering determination, Obi's lawyer left no stone unturned in safeguarding his client's political aspiration. The objection raised by opposition forces sought to bar Peter Obi from any further election, making the stakeholder incredibly high as it could shape the course of his political career. On March 1, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, declared Bola Ahmed Tunumbu of the All Progressive Congress, APC, the winner of the presidential election. The Liberal Party, as part of the opposition, costs, has filed a petition before the presidential election petition called PEPC, seeking to nullify the presidential poll, sitting on no compliance with the Electoral Act 2022. President Tunumbu's lawyer responded by requesting the tribunal to be told bar Peter Obi from contesting in future election if the court nullified the February 25th poll. In reaction to this, Obi legal term has issued a response. Amidst the ongoing hearing at the presidential tribunal, the Labour Party and his presidential um, candidate Twitter Obi have dis discredited President Bola Metunubu's tweeting address following the outcome of the February presidential election. Obi's lawyer referred to Tunubu's terms recent outburst as desperation taken too far. The situation remains tense as tribunal continues to address the matter. As per a report by Nigerian Tribunal on, fr on Friday, July 21, the petitioners res represented by Peter Obi's lead counsel, Live Uzochuku San, precise in their final written address that truncate the rule of law would lead to anarchy. The written address was duly sent to Mesa Tunumbu and Kazim Shetima for their at attention. The address partly read, this is a cheap, misguided, and destructive blackmail clearly intended to target the country's judiciary, judiciary and constitutionalism. It also aimed at um, cannibalizing our democracy. It, start, it, it stated further, when has it become offensive for petitioner to canvass a ground prescribed for challenging of an election in section? 1341B of the Election Act. The situation taken too far can be extremely dangerous. The intense courtroom drama surrounding Peter Obi's candidacy has gripped the nation, transforming tribunal into a battleground of legal expertise and political importance. With both um, sides fervently presenting their cases and anxiously awaiting tribunal's ruling, the future of Peter Obi's political ambition remains uncertain. The affirmation of his heightened legal battle will undoubtedly have a profound impact on the Nigerian political landscape and overall democracy process. Tribunal proceeding took on an unexpected and intensive tone, with Peter Obi lawyer responding passionately to an objection aimed at preventing the politicians from participating in future elections. The cartoon was ablaze with tension as the high stake legal battle unfolded, posing a crucial challenge to Peter Obi's candidacy in upcoming election. With unwavering determination, Obi's lawyer left no stone unturned in safeguarding his client's political aspiration. The objection raised by opposition forces sought to bar Peter Obi from any further election, making the stakeholder incredibly high as it could shape the course of his political career. On March 1, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, declared Bola Ahmed Tunumbu of the All Progressive Congress, APC, the winner of the presidential election. The Liberal Party, as part of the opposition, costs, has filed a petition before the presidential election petition called PEPC, seeking to nullify the presidential poll, sitting on no compliance with the Electoral Act 2022. President Tunumbu's lawyer responded by requesting the tribunal to be told bar Peter Obi from contesting in future election if the court nullified the February 25th poll. In reaction to this, Obi legal term has issued a response. Amidst the ongoing hearing at the presidential tribunal, the Labour Party and his presidential um, candidate Twitter Obi have dis discredited President Bola Metunubu's tweeting address following the outcome of the February presidential election. Obi's lawyer referred to Tunubu's terms recent outburst as desperation taken too far. The situation remains tense as tribunal continue to address the matter. 
As per a report by Nigerian Tribune on, fri on Friday, July 21, the petitioners were represented by Peter Obi's lead counsel, Liver Uzotuku San, besides in their final written address that truncate the rule of law would lead to anarchy. The written address was duly sent to Mesa Tunubu and Kazim Shetima for their attention. The address partly read, this is a cheap, misguided, and destructive blackmail clearly intended to target the country judicialist. All right, viewers, you have listened to today's news. Hmm. The headline says, Tribunal on fire. Tension arises and Sudanbu moves to bar Obi from future election. His lawyer react. So because somebody decided to rise up and say, no, I will not take the results I never gave to Nigeria. I will take it to court. He's not, he has not turned to a bad man. See, there's something that Nigerian feel to, Nigerians feel to understand that everybody has rights. We said we are, we are, we, we uh, Nigerian is a demo, is, is a democracy. Um, they, 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 they govern in a democracy way, but we all know that that's a big fat lie. They, they, they are not governing the country in a democracy because if they are, they will allow people to exercise their rights. So because Peter Obina took the matter to court, now Tunubu is not saying that eh, that they will now um. And Peter Obi will no longer. They want to. They want to buy his 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 future ele his social ambition for election. They want to buy. It. Thank God for his lawyer who stood up and had to like fight back with words and proof. You know that's why it's good when you, when you are having when you are going to court. Get a competent lawyer. Every people are going to law school. People studied law. Please get. It's not about getting anyhow lawyer. It's getting a competent lawyer that can defend you in court because most times when the going case to find in in court your lawyers intend to bring in a back-to-back -back thing to help defend you because any mistake can really affect you that that took matters to court imagine going to court and, 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 you, and you are bringing a big bad lawyer that is not competent a lawyer that, that does not have everything that does not have what it takes to defend you you are going to lose your money yourself your in fact everything about you you will lose you, you will lose you will lose them in the court Thank God for he thank God for his lawyer who stood up and was saying that was saying all manner of things that that is respectful but very intentional and um he 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 did that with with a wide spread of his knowledge and um he has everything. Okay, Tunubu yeah is saying that before because Tunubu Peter will be to take um took the matters to court, definitely they want to they want to they want to tarnish his 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 his, 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 his um, um um what is it called presidential ele election um um a um, mandate they want to they want to spoil his 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 vibes so because he took Tunubus to court now is that he batting you can take anybody to court as long as you have proof you have you have what it takes to prove the fact that the person you person, the person you are taking to court truly and uh, did what you said what you are trying to what you are accusing him or her of you understand well so me, my friend, my friend will always say, if you show for you leave out. If truly you know that you want the election, just calm down. Let the tribunal continue their this thing. Bring your evidence. This is court case. This is not back back. It's court case. Bring your if you have evidence, bring it and prove that of the truth. Peter is lying. Bring your evidence. If you show for you, leave out. We'll see as you go to be. All right, viewers, we have content of today's news. Please do it by the comment section. Let us know what your views are. Thank you for listening.